Okay, uh, this is Friday, September 2nd. You've seen the uh, street safe construction. Nothing's going on. It's not going on. Uh, that's our uh, great uh, friend at uh, Ina A. Tuxedos. Uh, so, what's new? Right? Well, what's new or old is that. Uh, this, the master drain that uh, they designed to go in here to replace the existing master drain. The new one didn't fit. Once they got in, they found out it doesn't fit. And um, so, you know, at first I thought, well, this is construction, this happens. But then I realized the financial consequences, which are really uh, serious. I mean, they're, they're overwhelming. They're disastrous. Um, so then you say, well, could they have foreseen that their master drain was not going to fit? And I don't have the answer to that, but I'm suspicious uh, because uh, all of these things are well documented in county records. And um, uh, bottom line is, I don't think they did their homework. And the good news is, uh, it may have been the very incredibly uh, successful firm of Cooper Robertson, which has to its credits having worked and been a part of redesigning the new, the replacement of the World Trade Center. So, you know, they're, let's just call them, uh, they had that sacred responsibility and fulfilled it. So there are heroes. But uh, even heroes can be negligent. And so my question personally to myself and to others is, did Cooper Robertson, who has won an international awards with things in uh, Paris, France, and so on. By the way, this is interesting. They say it's unsafe for us to give water away to people in traffic, but uh, who is this? That's the flyer department uh, soliciting funds and contributions to people in traffic. Now, if it's unsafe for us, why is it unsafe? For, why is it not unsafe for them? We want to give away free water to people suffering, and they say it's illegal, but they can do it. Look at this. This is an important video here. Um, so, going back to Cooper Robertson, our heroes—did they fail us? Did they hurt us? I, I need to find out. <laughs>